So just turned on the Perry Lane, actually off of Kinner Hill Road back there. Kinner Hill Road is uh, we're over by where we ran. My buddy Joe and Adrian, with Joe Charlton, Fort LaBeouf. Joe uh, actually, Joe Charlton, one of my teammates in college, he uh, li lives off of that. They said the Edinburgh wrestlers used to run by his house when they had the camps. So here's like a student housing and whatnot. And here is the campus. And I know guys like Alex Clemson and uh, Matt Hill are going to watch this. They get a watery eye, I think. They talk about how special this place is to them and, and uh, the Edinburgh campus. And a lot of people, it's a small college, but you know, it's, uh, it's not for everyone, but I can see how it could be a special place to a lot of people. Like the aforementioned Alex Clemson and, and Matt Hill. They, they can't say enough good places and things about this place. So, might look like a little Pennsylvania borough to most, but uh, they take the wrestling seriously and they hold it in high esteem and treat those guys like they're like they're the big time athletes on campus. They got a new, uh, I think that's a new like student center. I don't know. We're gonna do the campus tour. I'll learn more this spring. But uh, there's Macomb Fieldhouse. And there's their new. Uh, marshmallow dome that they had built so Macomb that's where the wrestling room is and that's where the dual meet was last night so it's a cool little town there's the football stadium I think they just got field turf so so pretty cool I, I mean I like coming here and obviously you can see there's a little bit of snow nothing too bad um, so yeah I, I like coming here and I like seeing the Charlton's Charlton's their Edinburgh fans. Person in that car thinks I'm nuts. But uh just different things all together. I like coming to Pennsylvania. I only live about an hour and fifteen minutes, not even that. I made it yesterday in under an hour and ten for the duel, so it was cool. But uh gonna just go right into town here and show you the thriving metropolis that is Edinburgh, Pennsylvania. Nice little rolling hills and Nice for running and training athletes. And there's their new uh, marshmallow dome here, just off the on the campus. There's the pretty cool. I haven't been in there yet, but I'm sure we'll get in there. Their indoor uh, facility. But there you go. There's a better view of it. A new addition here, doesn't bro? So. Pretty cool place. I had to get the 6N. There it comes. There's coming the 6N. I believe this is the copper coin coming up to my right. Indeed it is. There's an establishment that we visited last night with the Charlton's. I'm thinking I'm running red, but there's a green arrow there, peeps. So here's the country fair. You can hop on 79, go to Pittsburgh, or 79 North and go to Erie. Or south of Erie, maybe 10, 15 minutes at the most. So this is it. This is where it goes down. There's downtown to your left. I believe we were at the hotel last night. We went and checked that out, Edinburgh Hotel. So there's the thriving downtown. And uh, it's a good place to be. People are so friendly. Even the college kids are friendly, which you don't see all the time. And there's a lake up here. And then I want to say McLean High School. I'm not sure. I'd have to check on that. McLean High School, General McLean, is where the, all the Edinburgh kids go to school. There's the Edinburgh Inn. Copper kettle too. Back there. Oh, this place is sweet. This lakeside. There's the Edinburgh Lake back behind it. Pretty cool. 
A lot of college kids live back in that community right there. There's the lake right behind it. So, yeah, it's a pretty brief car tour of Edinburgh. And uh, this might be the middle school coming up, I think, and the golf course. Rick and Chick Charlton, man, they're my uh, hosts every time I come here out there on Kinner Hill. Good people, good wrestling people. Son was my roommate in college. I think uh, that's the middle school. So just a good place, good people. If you ever get a chance to come here, talk to Coach Flynn, he's a great guy. They love wrestling here.